four reasons why container is better than groups in Power App. Groups are an aid for app making. They don't have properties of their own and don't affect the layout of the app. In contrast, containers are actual controls with their own properties like width and border color. In a group, all the controls are bundled together because there is no option for subgroups. Containers, you can easily define the structure of the controls using subcontainers. In a container, I can take an existing control, do a control C and a control V, and it stays inside. I can also take an external control, do a cut and paste it directly inside the container. It is that simple and efficient. When it comes to groups, you do not have the option to select an external control, do a control C, select a control inside the group and do a control V. It always pastes outside the group. And because containers are so efficient, you can take a group and convert it into a container. You cannot convert a container into a group.